at uh, my location for this stealth camp. Don't know why you should call them stealth camps because I don't usually uh, hide. I just park up somewhere uh, reasonable. Ooh. I'll just show this lovely location I'm at this time. Dogs had a nice bone, bit of a pulling on the side of a hill. On the we'll come down. Or us, if I can keep the camera level. Come down over that bad boy. Down, 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 down to there. Level up again. That's the level. Round to there. Oh, then up there. I think there's a, a loose cow there at the moment. Yeah, so I wouldn't like to try and get out of here when it's wet. I think I'd have to take a bit of a run at it. So, uh, there's the nice little valley there. Set of hills there, and I'm uh, tucked in here. Just the job. <clears throat> Got the old uh, panel on again. There, swing back round. And back round, yeah, so. Yeah, the only uh, drawback is I got no phone signal, so the missus is going to be pretty peeved. But I did walk over that brow and onto another hill. Um, I couldn't. I could send a text, but I couldn't uh, use the phone. So, uh, hope you bear with me. Hmm. Right. Things to do. You can uh, just see the top of me van from here. I'll zoom in, there she is. Back out, if I can. There she goes. Out with the good old prepping dog again. Had to chuck her in the, in the string because she uh, went down in a bog in there. And she was up to her neck. It's absolutely gorgeous, as you can see. A nice little valley and a few hills about. So yeah, I should be uh, parked up there for a couple nights. There. There, there is a peat bog there, and that's the sort of thing you want to keep out of. So if you imagine you was uh, wandering up here with it snowing, or really bad poor visibility, and you walked into that, the chances are you might get out, but there's chances you might not get out. So uh, just to let you know what is a underfoot up on top of here I'll slowly uh, swing around I don't know if you can hear me with the with the wind noise Oink. 
Oh. Got to keep an eye on her. She might uh, try and uh, sneak in there. Well, not a lot that way. I'm just surrounded by uh, big hills. My van, <laughs> Roxy, is way back that way. So what I'll do is I'll keep walking that way. I can see a track um, until I pick up the road, which I reckon is pretty well down over there. So uh, I set up my GPS on my phone now. So uh, when I left, well, when I got to the van or parked the van up, I put a marker there so what I gotta do is follow my own uh, phone back to me van that's it just the thing to keep your eyes out for it's a bit like that uh, sinkhole you know you could be walking around uh, oh this is lovely then all of a sudden the mist come down and this is what it like you cannot see where the ranges and the hills are so this is when you've got to rely on your uh, compass more than anything yeah it just goes to show that you've got to be prepared there it's rolling in it's getting thicker and thicker Right in front of your eyes, they are it's disappearing. Oh, which way am I walking? Oh, could be worse, could be raining. <laughs> <laughs> 